Sea ice is frozen seawater, so it is very different from an iceberg, which is coming from land ice. Sea ice is much thinner. It tends to be less than a meter thick in the Antarctic. Climatologist Claire Parkinson is trying to solve the mystery of why the amount of sea ice around Antarctica has dramatically declined. It tends to, at the peak of winter, be roughly 18 million square kilometers, which is a very large area. And in the summertime, it's much, much less, more like three million square kilometers. In a sudden turnaround, satellite analysis shows that sea ice went from its highest level in recent decades to its lowest. From 2014 to 2017, it went all the way from the highest value in the 40-year record to the lowest value in the 40-year record. So huge change in just three years. So in that, in that three year period, it lost over two million square kilometers of ice. That's a, larger than the area of Mexico of ice decrease that you had. In the Arctic, it took over 40 years to have the yearly average Arctic sea ice lose that much. A reduction in sea ice affects wildlife and according to Claire Parkinson, it has an impact on global warming. Way, way, way too slushy. Uh, there's a bit of snow free ice there. Yeah. Yeah, that was really slushy. Right? Yeah. As the sun's radiation comes down, strikes the surface, if the surface is sea ice, most of that sun's radiation gets reflected off and goes back to space. If the sea ice isn't there, and the sun's radiation comes down and instead strikes the liquid ocean, then most of the sun's radiation that strikes that ocean gets absorbed in the ocean, stays within the Earth atmosphere system, and contributes to warming the system up. As to what's behind the change in sea ice levels, theories range from the hole in the ozone layer to shifting wind patterns. Scientists say it's complicated and caution against pinning the decline to climate change. The why is a huge puzzle for scientists right now. People have certainly thought that maybe uh, warming has finally spread more around the Antarctic than it had been, but there is no consensus yet on why the Antarctic sea ice cover has taken these changes that it has. Hi, I'm Lee Sales. Thanks for watching this story. If you'd like to watch more of 730's stories, they are on the left of your screen. And tap on the button below to subscribe and get the latest from ABC News.